but I'm going to take the supers off the two hives feed them I'm going to ang slope them this way a little bit so the water can drain off of the entrance for winter and then I have a couple of ventilation bo uh, ventilation box for each hive I'm going to stick on and it just consists of uh, it's just a super pretty much that I've taken and drilled holes in all the way through I put this on to keep the rain from getting in even though I drilled the holes at an upward angle and there's a piece of screen over that hole so the bees can't get in and that hole is kind of an extra extra hole thanks to the little rodents running around here and then I have a new ventilation box I'm going to try out this year, it was suggested. I've just got a piece of fabric screen on the bottom of this. Then I took a queen excluder and put it on the bottom to help hold the weight of the sawdust. Now I'm going to spread it out to about a two and a half, three inch layer. Then I'm going to take this piece of styrofoam quarter inch styrofoam I'm going to push it down over the top of it and it has ventilation holes two on each side all the way around it